Hey guys, and welcome back to Summer. When we last left off, ooh, we'd found the Dumbat, and essentially, we'd made us our way to Theta. However, this place is, or at least appears to be, long dead. We need to find a cipher program to get access to the Dumbat as well, uh, as it appears to have been quarantined for reasons that we are not aware of. Probably something to do with the uh, the warden system screwing everything up. Anywho, let's have a little look around. Let's get some of these off here. We haven't found any monsters or anything yet. In fact, the game has been fairly light on monsters so far, but that's okay. I'm sure, I'm sure they're coming. So, what have we got here? <clears throat> Dear, fri ah. Dear friends, when you read this, I would have entered the Ark. I have explained this uh, is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. Not to frighten Catherine, I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and packing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announce completion, I will bite down, quickly causing my own demise. When you discover the truth behind my death, know that there's no tragedy to mourn, for I am victorious. I advise you all to do the same and join me in the Ark. Right, well, add Victoria, matey. <clears throat> um, oh, look at all these. Uh, I can't sadly read what it says on these. UHS? UHS? It's like radio waves. Question marks. Some kind of equation there. Lots of equations. Ah, and that's the weird... Um, health thing. Right, what else have we got in here then? Oh, hello. Classified. Cartridge. Intelligence analyst. Theta. Um, Mark Saring. The company is very pleased to hear your success in making the Wu Station wide presence. We trust you appreciate what a unique opportunity this is. And that you will do everything in your power to fully explore and understand this mystery. To do so, you need to ensure that Dr. John Ross is able to steer and study the Wu from Alpha without outside interference. In case of an emergency, you may direct Julia Dull at Omicron to forcefully eliminate any opposition, but please make an effort to avoid extreme actions. The wow is important costly affair and we hope to follow steady development without setbacks um okay oh, I can't read that some kind of report hmm so more was going on here No idea what that is. That's the wow. Well, I'm sure we're going to come in contact with this thing eventually. What's that? I have no idea. It's gone now. Um, lots of post-its. I would have thought... Ooh. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days, while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. Mm -hmm. I, I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain, but a continuous immersion. 
emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt, no less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the Ark. Let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars. Hmm. Very interesting. It's a romantic thought that it works like that, but uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. I think once your body dies, your body dies. Game over, man. Game over. Alright, Robin. Still no beasties. I'm sure the beasties are coming, though. What have we got? Yes. Something. Is that just ambient music? Yeah, I think we're okay. Right, what have we got? <clears throat> oh, that's Robin. I like her hair. Huh. Cool looking kid, I guess. We're all dying anyway. I'm all in. I should put my faith in. Ah, uh, ha, ha. Yes, well, you do that. Again, it, you know. It's a romantic thought, but. Ah, kitty! Looks like Garfield. Huh. I still want to know why the robots are killing each other. Or, well, everyone, really. Um, well, it looks like whatever method she used to kill herself... It wasn't very clean. She could have used the cyanide like everyone else. Or at least, like the other guy. Get that shit out of here. Yeah, man. There we go. So that was Robin. That was the girl that we met outside. What's this? No. And of course by girl I mean a robot. Another hairbrush. Same standard issue green hairbrush. Oh, cat bowl perhaps? Desk tidy? For auntie. Something she made when she was young? Huh. Who knows? More post-its. Got those strength trainers. And... These things. Oh, the penny drops. Okay, cool. Right. Ah. Suicide note. Get that shit out of here. Huh. Mr. Steven. Oh, let's get out of it. If they want to kill themselves, that's fine. You know. Damn it. Sounds like... Oh, it's just the, the gel dripping from the wolf system. I gotcha. Now, 
I wouldn't say no to some lighting, of course. But, uh... That is a luxury, I guess, that we cannot afford. Right, nothing in here. Get out of here. Nope. 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 Um... We could fondle that, but the thing, we don't need to. I mean, I don't even know how the health system works in this game. If indeed... Oh. Ooh. Ooh, what's that? Hey, pal. Ah. Well, uh, we can't get through there. But it looks like we've got someone to play with. Not exactly sure what that something is. Oh yeah, the lights are out. Uh, well, we can't go that way. We can potentially go that way, but we can also go this way. This looks about right. Ooh. Ooh. Might get a monster through here. Get out of there. Well, this is where they were scanning people, I guess. Research. Welcome to my place. Ooh. When right. I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. Hmm. Any uh, threats that we should know of, Catherine? Considering you're, you know, wired into the system now. Simulation assets. Ooh. What's that? I guess we have it on us now. Alright. Really, look look at this webcam. I mean, seriously. Oh, we can fiddle with the computer. Uh, connection error. Troubleshoot. Uh, error code. Unable to connect to mainframe. Please reset router on the sub-level vault. Or contact maintenance. Alright. So, sub-level? So, we're going to have to go down. Alright. Uh, oh, hello. Yes, no? Gonna give us the same shit? Yeah, same shit. Okay, so... We now roughly know what we're doing? Why did he get that out? Ah, there we go. Need to fix that mainframe connection. Yeah, 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 we're on it, we're on it, we're on it. So, this is where I restore Ooh. the arc scans. So you saved the whole staff digitally on these chips? That was the plan. Hmm. Oh, look at these. Bust. Damn. Broken. I guess not everybody survived then. Damaged. Although... Wow, what a waste. Although... I'm guessing uh, everyone's already uploaded into the Ark, maybe? Otherwise, that's kind of a sad loss. Never mind. All these cartridges just destroyed. Ooh. That one looks alright. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Ah, so, um, profit, I suppose. So how comes that one survived? Different brand, maybe? Who knows? Something, you know what? There's something, um, pleasing about playing with all these. I don't know. It feels good. Do you know what I really wish? I wish I was playing this game. Uh, with an Oculus Rift or some kind of virtual reality. I really, you know what, I might have to invest in one of those. This game would be so good for it. Uh, so we need to go downstairs, I'm guessing. Oh, hello. Oh. 
This is where I did my scam. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scam was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Hmm. Makes sense. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. Mm -hmm. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. Shit. Well. <sighs> ah, chip reader. I suppose we could plug that chip in anyway, I suppose. Pilot seat. Ah, very similar to what we had back in Canada. Research, cartography, maintenance. Interesting that we had the similar prototype all the way back then. Ah, I see. What? Uh, what? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. All right. Well, um, non comp, uh, compressed uh, Nagajama neurograph, continuous time. 21 milliseconds. Jesus, it's pretty quick. Berg. Are we supposed to be erasing the data? What are we doing here? David Munchie. Ah. Oh. What is this? How the hell did that happen? Jarrett. Kath, what is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. A legacy scan. Right. Okay, that's it. Wow. That was fun. That's a relief. So Still that figuring this out, so. It was freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are going to run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. Yeah, well, why do I get the feeling you shouldn't get too excited? Um, so, we actually get to find out, I guess, what happened to us. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're going to keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. All right. The model was sound. It should have worked. It's mm -hmm. not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now. The brain damage. You guys, everything. It's made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. Now that, <laughs> that makes you think. 
What's a legacy skin? They're historic mm. templates for AI construction. Any self-respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Basically. Huh. Well, at least my theory was correct. <clears throat> Simon died. Uh, the treatment failed. That's, in a way, that's a little bit sad because uh, it, it was kind of obvious. Um, you know. But, uh, well. I guess it does add some context. <clears throat> At least uh, Simon gets to live on. And he gets one more roll of the dice, and this time, to do something uh, interesting. The last report filed by the staff mentioned struggling with something called a proxy. The proxy we killed was blind, just like Acres, but it listens. Careful, we spotted two more by the infirmary. What do they look like? Not sure. It seems to be human enough to pass for a crew member at a distance. Tall, dark, and ultimately faceless seems to be what to look out for. Hmm. Keep my eyes open. A proxy. Well, right you are. Okay, so how the frick... I'm guessing <clears throat> this is where we're supposed to be going. Kind of. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathway already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and machinery and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. Truly sentient machines, thinking they are people, is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. Hmm. Intriguing. So, we have a new enemy, as predicted. <clears throat> we have something called a proxy, which looks like a human. Without a face. Well... That sounds like fun. So they're blind, but they can hear. Okay. And Anders, or Anchors, was the first one. Well, 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 well. What do you say, Simon? Once more into the breach? Hey there. Well, shit. Hey, fella. Let's get a good look at you. Blind. Apparently. Oh, we are close. Now, I have no idea how good these things, how good their hearing is. Or they're, well, they're blind, so. <clears throat> Interesting. Hey, if they're blind. Oh, fuck. Uh, hello. Hi right, mate. Who are you? I wish we could talk to these people. Is that Anders? Who would have been down here? Is that Karen? 
or capped. I'm going to be really careful about moving that. Music's kicked up. I guess if the music kicks up, it's coming for us? Or at least it knows roughly where we are. Sounds like a fucking zombie. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Well, it looks like a bloater. Kind of. Well, we're going to sneak around. It's coming around this way by the sounds of things. Man, I miss my surround sound. <clears throat> have to be very careful not to knock anything over. I also have no idea what I'm looking for. Assuming some kind of switch. I want to investigate that guy some more, but I guess he's just dead. Ooh. Now, although it says they're blind, I don't know if they would somehow detect the flashlight. That doesn't make a lot of sense if they're blind, but... I don't want to risk it. Also... I have no idea... if we're in the right area. Pretty interesting looking things. It's like a zombie. Now, did it react to the light? Yes. Yes, I think it did. Unless it heard to the click of me turning the light on. Further research is needed. Right, can you jog on, mate? Yeah, they reminded me a little bit of those... Uh, big guys from RE6. I don't know what it heard there. I don't know. Is it those little post-it note things that I walked into? Alright, matey. Come on now. Come on. I have no idea how good it's hearing is. We're going to wait for it to jog on a little bit. Right, so that... Ladies and gentlemen, is a proxy. Okay, fuck it. Okay, cool. So, if I was some kind of switch that I needed to reset the mainframe, where the Bloody hell, would I be? We've been down there. We haven't been right in the corner yet. Ah, fuck. I'm assuming crouching is completely quiet. Seems to be. Go on, mate. Piss off. There you go. Okay, cool. 
Yeah. Doesn't appear to hear us at all. Good. This is very good. Right, so. Now we're away. What the devil are we looking for? That's him. Ah! Well, this looks fiddleable. Network error. Unable to connect to the mainframe. Please reset the router. Uh, sure. Where's... Alright. Where's the router? And sod's law. There has to be lots of bits and bobs for us to trip into around it. Might have heard that. At least there's somewhere nice to hide here. So, there might... I'm guessing we've got to follow that cable. Can it see the light? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so follow... Hang on, we've got a couple of cables here. Is there any... Ah, shit. If we stand up, in theory... It just straight up shouldn't see us. So we've got one cable going down there. One cable going over here. But this being a server... That's kind of normal, really. The server farm. Uh, yeah. Oh, hello. Ah. There's another one. Well, I'm pretty sure he just said help me. Well, I... I would like to help you, but I can't, because we're a pup, and we don't like murder. Uh, if it was up to me, my good sir, I would happily put you out of your misery. So, keep going this way, there's that orange cable. Trouble is, these all have orange cables. can't really just get up and have a bit of a run around either. Look at all these bloody physics objects everywhere. Alright. Now. Anything? There's nothing there. I would have thought this would have been fairly obvious unless... Right, this is back the way we came. Unless we need to get back out here. The router might be in one of those other rooms. Which would be a bit of a pain in the ass, but uh, at the same time kind of makes sense. Now, I have no idea if they can open doors. So, what have we got here? That's got like a H written on it. Ah, oh, they all have. Alright. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh. Oh, well, that... To be fair, narrows it down somewhat. So this room... is fucked. Oh. Crumbs. Well, that's a kick in the knickers. The fucker can come out. Um. 
Okay, so. Enemies can open doors. Oh, we're going to get a look at it now. It's just like a big blob of meat. Well, um, thanks for opening the door, I guess. So, I'm guessing the router is down here. So, he's, yeah, he's basically following us. It would seem. Or were we just the world's most unlucky individual? Yeah, jog on. Piss off back to your area. So, I'm pretty sure they mentioned there was two of these. So I guess there's going to be one in there and one in there. Because, why the fuck not, right? Why have one when you can have two? Ah, for God, mate, seriously? I mean, honestly, I'm trying to do something here. It's a shame we can't seal the room. Yes, that would be quite... That would be quite cool if we could actually lock the room down. Right, I'm guessing. Oh, hey, pal. Ah. In he comes. Yeah, he's definitely following us. There's no question about that. Which is... A little bit strange. Oh, he does have a little face on him. Go on, you. <sighs> Off you go. I'm sure there's somebody over there you can bother. No, no, not not over... Th yeah, over there. Back where you came from. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Or girl. Kind of hard to tell, to be honest. Uh, right. Uh, wait, what? Is that something to play with? Um. Oh. Okay. There's got to be a switch or a knob or a uh, button or something. I would really like it, sir, if you got the fuck out of here. I need to have a good look around this room. And you're making that incredibly difficult. You're like a manager at work who instead of, you know, fucking off and letting you get on with the task would constantly come around meddling and fucking whining and look, keep going. You're on. That's right. I can figure this out without your help. Go make me a coffee or something. Make yourself useful. Um, right, so that, I mean, that looks like, what have we got here? Oh, hang on, that's Theta Life Environmental Control. Ah, uh, yes. Waste management is failing. Recycling is at on 2%. Energy recovery is on 17%. Purifier is 31%. Gas mix is good. CO2 process is good. Temperature is 6 degrees. It's quite cold here. Hmm. What is your problem, mate? Seriously? A fucking metal or something. Good God. Yeah, okay, so I guess the way the AI is programmed... They do sort of loiter around you. I bet you, if we went into the other room... I bet if we went into the other room... He would follow us. Now... I'm not seeing any switches or anything obvious in here. So I'm guessing everything we need... I mean, there's that there, but there's no way we're getting that. 
Unless we could throw something at it, but I can't really see how that would help. Now, getting out of here is going to be the next challenge. Ah, in he comes. In he comes. You're going to be a pain in the ass. Just like... Well, okay, okay. I'll give you, I'll give you um, some credit. You're not quite as irritating. Oops, there goes my phone. One second, guys. Right, sorry about that interruption, guys. I had about a thousand things happen at once. Oh, yeah. Um, and by a thousand things, uh, I actually really mean three things, but uh, still, three and a thousand are quite similar. Um, hmm. Right, well, we obviously need to go back into the other room, I guess. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know, but then why would this room be here? I mean, that is a pretty big red flag there, although it's green. But there's no way we can get to it. This gentleman is having a bit of a bad time. Ah, for fuck's sake. Look, seriously, pal. You're riding my last nerve right about now. I know, buddy. You have to put up with this all the fucking time. Is this what he does? Just wanders aimlessly from room to room looking for somebody to kill. I really want to turn my flashlight on just to see if he goes for me. Really tempted, but I don't know what happens if we get caught. Come on. Keep it moving, mister. Don't make me put a foot up your ass. I really wish I could do that. Sorry, buddy. Yeah. One day you will die. Although, you know, you might get trapped in some kind of machine body. Let's go examine that console again. No, 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 you don't, sir. No, you don't. Now, where the fuck was that console? Uh, it was, like, down here somewhere. Yeah, so, um, maybe there's a button we've overlooked. But I'm pretty confident. Ah, shit. I'm pretty confident it's going to be something to do with following the cables, perhaps. Um, this room is really... Oh. Hard to navigate. We've got more... those data tape things there. Sneak past the drill. Uh, this way? Uh, this is looking like it. Ah, here we go. Right. <sighs> so, carbon 2D mainframe. Uh, looks like a standard server rack. <sighs> really? Improper reset may cause system is fuck's sake. Uh, I'm guessing if we push that, he's gonna come running. Oh, what the fuck's that? Uh, please stand by for manual com. All right. So what? Do we have to push it again? Come on, you bastard. What is this, a fucking 486? Come on. It sounds like it's a 486. Flip switch. Okay. 
Mainframe online. Ah. Oh. And the monster didn't come at us. I'm actually surprised. Right. Well, that was kind of cool and a pain in the ass at the same time. Really going to have to examine these a little bit more carefully in the future. There he is. Which way are you going, pal? Good lad. Good lad. Now, which was the fucking way out? It's down here somewhere. I think. Right, so we should be set now to go... Ah, sweet. We should be all set now to go back upstairs, I believe. Right, let's shut you down. And shut you down. We're keeping the place nice. You know what? Let's just move. Okay. So I have no idea if this guy... Oh, I see. If this guy is going to follow us. I don't really know how the enemies... Like, how the AI really works. Good job, Simon. This better have worked. I'm not going down there again. Okay, well, it sounds like there's another one. What the fuck was that? It's like vomiting juice. So, you're not worried that there are other Simons or Catherines running around out there? Uh, now I am. Geez, Simon, some thoughts are better left alone. Huh. Yes, I guess so. Right, well, cool. Uh, I'm guessing there are more through there, which kind of makes sense. Now, are there some down here now? So, what's quite interesting about this stuff as well is... This is the, um, what the, the world system. If you knew about me. What do you mean? You do know about yourself. No, I, I mean the real Simon. The human Simon. He'd probably well, be happy. Reactions, I'd say he'd be pretty upset. Hmm. Well, I would say he's probably quite happy. Knowing that a part of himself lived on. Because, uh... If you remember, matey, we died. You died. So yeah. Go ahead. Plug in that chip you found. Uh that's the plan. Oh I see. Two little devices. Right, slot one chip, okay. Loading environment data. Slot two chip. There should be a list of people. Ooh. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Uh security you say. So uh death. Nationality Greenlander. She said she'd help out delivering the Ark. Killed himself because of the continuity. Uh -huh. Strollmider is really mad. Tightening security. Ark project on hold. Uh, 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 uh. So that's when they were captured. Data refugee. Oh, Delta refugee. Construction wrangler. He's working. No. Another fucking continuity suicide. <laughs> Locked out of the lab again. We look so much alike. In different life, I'm sure we'd be best friend. Uh huh. Why? Just because you look alike. I've seen people that look like me. It doesn't mean, oh, I'm instantly going to be friends. Ridiculous. Ah, oh, I guess she was. Agent as well then. Well, okay then. Um, Heather Wolchek. She helped me cut the wave leak from the helmet. Um, if anything, it should make the post-scan hangover less severe. Um, Heather, maybe? Peter Starsky. 
cheerful and funny. Uh, said she'd help construct the ark, but not to carry it. Right. Construct. So... Let's try her. She must have some kind of technical information. No, we need someone from Theta Security Group. Oh, okay. Uh, Theta. Robin? I mean, technically, we just, you know, killed her outside. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Strohmeyer. All right, Stromeyer. Uh, none of those are here. We just got to go down, everybody, one by one. No, I don't think so. Stromar recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher, if you can find one of them. Oh, we did actually have... Yeah. Refugee. He came from one of the other sites. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. Alright. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Um... Let's put him out on the beach. Let's be nice. That wasn't so bad. What the fuck? Sure, my really got me worked up, bastard. What? How did I get here? Mr. Wan, I need your help. Doctor Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Listen, I really need your help. I need the new security cipher. He's getting Dr. stressed. Chun. I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here. It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here. Uh, Did we just bring that guy to life? Okay. He's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was going to work. Maybe we can try again. Yeah, let's give him the ski lodge. But maybe, an environment of nothing, maybe he will think he's asleep or something. That wasn't oh. so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. There's no need to worry. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wong. No, 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 no. Why, <laughs> why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you. You need to chill out, mate. Do we need uh, to you know... Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's really? keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Okay. Try the ski lodge. It's quite fancy. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? What is this? Where am I? Take a deep breath, Mr. Wan. Everything is fine. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I need a favor. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. I'm trying to save a lot of people. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chun, or I'll punch your teeth in. Well, I think uh... we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Uh. Right. Okay. So how do we do that? What sort of data do we need? Uh, can I have that back? You can have that back. Uh, 
Right, well, more data. I mean, what, what? Do you want some discs? Well, I suppose if we have to construct... What, who was he? What was his name? Uh, Brandon? Can we choose someone else out of interest? Or is he the only person we can choose? Alright, so when you made your choice, you made your choice. Right, so. Brandon Wan. Uh, so if we need to know more about him. Maybe his uh, his apartment. Was that one of the buildings that we could get... Well, one of the rooms that we could get into? Um, I don't really know what else we can do. Brandon Wan. Most of these are still locked, though. Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Okay. Well, that was easy. Uh, Maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Well, that makes sense. Alright, so what have we got here? Castles? Looks like Chinese, maybe? Or Asian, anyway. Rounded roofs like that. Um, okay, does it. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, okay. we're right behind you. Well, we're not going to take too long, that's for sure. Heard some lady telling Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must mm -hmm. be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Yeah, that's we've been getting a few of those. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. Right. Now that's Japanese. So he likes castles and things. Boats. Fairchild Award. For achievements of the engineering youth. Alright. Right. So he's really a hole punch? A hundred years into the future we have hole punches. Sure. Uh, right. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Get that out of here. Ooh. Staff. Wrangler. Random one. Male. Chinese. Hong Kong. Service records. Profession. Wrangler. Look at that. That is some attention to detail right there. Alright. His missus, I guess. Cute. Yeah. Ooh. Brandon, I'm really a mess thinking about the scan. Everyone's being so brave. All smiles, no regrets. You know how you said you would hold my hand during the scan? If the offer still stands, I'd gratefully accept. If we do it together, we could suffer the hangover together as well. They say it takes a couple of days to recover. Ah. There's a note from Alice that makes me think she was scanned alongside Brandon. Okay, mm, that sounds really like promising. It. We can definitely use that. So I think we got this, mean. Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Good job Mate, it's a means to an end. I didn't know you could date a mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. <laughs> origami. I used to do quite a bit of origami, actually. Back in the day, what have we got here? Anchors finally agreed to evaluate, uh, evacuate Delta. Go, yeah. Korea and I moved to Theta today. Anchor said he'd stick around for a while longer. That crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. Yeah. I found more evidence suggesting they were together during the scan. That's okay, Sherlock. We got it already. 
We should focus on simulating Brandon and Juan. Uh-huh. Uh, did my arc scan together with Alice. Uh, Stromider told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. I was fine at first, but got a splitting headache a couple of hours later. The biggest pain was that ch that Chun girl. She's so fucking uncomfortable at all times, it makes my skin crawl. Strohmeyer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently Conrad wanted in on the uh, continuity... Uh, can't get that out. Continu unity. Uh, and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. Ah, cool. Just heard that the uh, Komobi survey team is going to Delta to pick up anchors. He's been alone for months now. I can't imagine what he's been up to. Yes, well, he's um, not exactly himself anymore. Well, we have what we need. Let's have a little fiddle about, shall we? I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with okay. Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. Right, well, where's your module? Oh, it's on the system. Uh, let's go for the speech, Alice. Run. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. Wow. What the hell happened? Where are we? This? This is the ark. We made it? I didn't realize it would work this way. Just one thing. What do you mean? They even got a new security cipher, remember? Yeah. The WoW lockout. Uh, someone messed up. We really need a key. Wait, this is crazy. You're not Alice. No, uh oh. I am. I promise. So you're lying. This is a trick. Mr. God Bond, damn it. I need you to calm down. This is fucking cold using Alice like that. Get out <laughs> of my face. Please, I really need that cipher. I'm not giving you anything. Take me back to Theta now. I'm not having any more of your bullshit. Uh. to do this. Come on, Simon. How many times it takes? Simon, you're a bit of a pussy, it's got to be said. Um, do we need more information, or do we just run it again? Do we need to look at in Alice's room? Is, she, is, is Alice's room even there? Maggie, Brandon. John. Mark. Robin. Martin. No, so. Uh, oh, there are more rooms there, though. Alright, well. I don't know. Are we just going to have to keep redoing the test until it works? That doesn't make a lot of sense. There's got to be more to this. Right, okay, so uh, ski lodge, run. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What happened to the room? Do you like it? Alice, where are we? We made it. It's the ark. But I need yeah. to ask you something. What? What's happening? The new security cipher? I need it. You're lying. You're not Alice. What did you do to her? It's going okay. To her. Why are you doing this? Right, so, well... We... Over? I mean, could he remember this hell we're putting him through? The simulation never affects the scan pattern. Each time is a fresh start. It's a little coming, I suppose. Look, mates. Look, Simon. Stop worrying about it, right? Uh, environment, none. There we go. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up. Bastard. Everything is okay now. Alice, what happened to the room? Nothing, nothing. nothing. I, it, it must be the scan, making you see things. 
Why are you acting like this? Me? Why are you acting like this? Whoever you are, you better get the fuck out of here. Please, I'm just trying to find a cipher. Well, what the hell is this? What have you done to me? What have you done to Alice? If she's hurt, I'll fucking end you. Mm. Well. For God's sake. Uh... Do we need another environment? Maybe we need another environment. One that makes more sense. Did we read all this? Yeah, kind of. Um, yes, we did. Uh, back to his room. Was that always open like that? Huh. Right, we're gonna have one more adventure back into the room. And if we can't work it out, I'm gonna have to cut off and we'll start again in the next video. Uh, right, so... a crane come on it's got to be something here didn't you didn't uh, get anything from any of these I mean is there no other modules that we can use that's the frog Hong Kong. Can we not make a a Chinese kind of hmm Chinese kind of setting maybe or a nice relaxing castle. I guess not. Um. Okay. Well, I I guess we keep going. Is it going to play out the same t same way every single time, though? Hmm. Is there no one else that we could use? No other working cartridges? No! Ah. Right, you bastard. You fucking give me that cipher, or I shall lock you in a torment that you won't fucking forget. That wasn't so bad. Yes, yes, sure yes. Really got me up, bastard. What a relief that it wasn't so bad. Alice, what happened to the room? Nothing happened. Are you sure you're feeling alright? Why are you acting like this? I'm normal, like always. Wherever you are, you better get the fuck out of here. It's not what you think. We're the good guys. Well, what the hell is this? What have you done to me? What have you done to Alice? I guess this is something that we just... Something we're just going to have to keep rerunning. Okay. Well, that's what I just said. I just said maybe we need to come up with something else. So this room might really got me worked up, bastard. See, this one looks promising. There's still people we have to save, and we need that key to do it. Wait, this is crazy. You're not Alice. That's not true. I'm Alice. No, you're lying. This is a trick. Mr. Wong, God damn it. This is fucking cold using Alice like that. Get out of my face. Mr. Wong, it's really important. I need, need to, to know, know the cipher. cipher. I'm not giving you anything. Take me back to Theta now. I'm not having any more of your bullshit. Uh. Simon, we need something new to work with. Yes. 
Yes, we do. Um, I'm not quite sure what we can get, though. Um, hmm. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to end this video here. I am... I'm going to have a think about this. I'm going to play around with a few things off camera. And when we come back, hopefully I would have figured it out. So, thanks for watching, guys. And until next time. Thank you.